the annual CMF International Conference 2019. This year, our theme is Empower 2019. When you talk about mission, it's not really the mission of the church. When you talk about mission, it is God's mission. The Bible is a missionary book and God is a missionary God. God have only one son and he sent him as a missionary to the world. The open hands of compassion and the building of new, strong relationships through trust is the thrust of missions and evangelism in Asia. The new communities have been reached with the gospel of Jesus Christ. Miracles, signs and wonders follow the preaching of the word of God and the young and old are ministered to with love. A few days ago, missionary Neomayan Raniva was packing her bags to prepare for this conference when she heard a knock at her door. Church member Ming had collapsed in their family plantation. Concerned relatives came by thinking Ming had died. Two hours later, she got up, thanked the missionary and went home. A few hours later, the couple came back with the biggest chicken they had on their farm to cook a meal for Neo Mai as her farewell dinner before she left the base in Ramchek village. For a poor Kui farmer, this was a big sacrifice. It is relationships like this that has touched the hearts of the people to see the love of Christ in and through the lives of the missionaries. In Palawan, Philippines, their new church is a great boost to the leaders and members as they see the manifestation of God's provision for a place of worship and mission base. In Vietnam, students undergo English classes to boost their language skills and also understand the gospel. Training is also conducted for the older members of the community who are interested to know more of Christ. One of the men attended only one training session and was confident enough to go and plant a church in his community. In the mission base at Ramchek village, Privahir, Cambodia, the new Metui Vinavo Mission Center that was opened recently will now be used to train more Kui people to reach out to their own tribes and villages. The Mission Center was a project undertaken by the women of CMF International and it stands as a testimony of the support of our women for missions. Funds raised from annual women's conferences go towards these projects. The borehole of fresh, clean drinking water on the land is also being bottled and sold to neighboring villages to generate much needed income for the needs in the field. As the reach increases in Asia, so does the need to sustain the work of evangelism in the areas of transport, new boreholes, water and sanitation, educational materials and the printing of evangelism tools. There's more yet to be saved. Let's synergize our efforts and resources to reach one more soul for the glory of God. This is your opportunity to partner with our missionaries in their various fields of mission in Asia. You can commit yourself to pray for them, or you can give to missions by becoming a covenant partner with a monthly gift and reading of their work in our bi-monthly mission publication, Harvest Times. Or you can support one of the many projects in the field or you can take short mission trips to the field and see for yourself the work of the missionaries. Our world mission team in the foyer is ready to serve you. And for those of you who are watching live tonight, you can be a part of this global mission conference by giving towards the work of missions in Asia by clicking on the donate button on our website, www.cmf.international. Let's keep the fire of intercession alight for our brethren in Asia that they will be empowered and equipped to reach their own with the gospel of Jesus Christ. The Great Commission is our mendate.